Welcome to Nuance Power PDF, Creating a Table of Contents. One of the more popular uses for Power PDF is to create long documents from multiple source documents. In this example, I've combined three different documents together. Now that I have a completely new document, I may want to incorporate a table of contents which doesn't exist at the moment. Without Power PDF, I would have to create this table of contents in Microsoft Word and import it into my document. The problem with this is that it's not linked to my actual PDF document. So if I continue to update it, I have to manually recreate the table of contents and import it again. Let me show you how easy it is to create a table of contents with Power PDF. A table of contents is created from bookmarks in my PDF document. Bookmarks are links to text, images, graphics, or pages in my PDF. As my PDF file grows or shrinks, the bookmarks stay correctly linked. Power PDF can then use these bookmarks to build an accurate and dynamic table of contents. Let me show you how easy it is to create a bookmark. I want to have a link and a table of contents entry at the start of this particular page. I'll select the first few words and add it as a bookmark. It doesn't matter that the text doesn't represent the name of my bookmark, as I can just change it to whatever makes sense. Now that I have my bookmarks the way that I want them, I just select Create Table of Contents from the Bookmarks option menu. A dialog appears, and now I can set a number of design and functionality options. I'm going to have my Table of Contents inserted after page 1. Here you have a final Table of Contents automatically created. If I add pages or bookmarks, I can then update them without having to recreate anything new. Power PDF is the perfect way to build PDF documents and add finishing touches such as a table of contents.